This is Mamata Sumeras. Welcome to another solution tutorial of Soil Dust. Today we are going to solve this 3D problem. In this 3D problem, this is the isometric view, this is the top view, this is the front view and this is the right side view. First we will start drawing from the top view. First I will draw this ring at the bottom. Uh, the ring has a dimension of 50 and another dimension of 35. So I will first select the top plane, then sketch. Now select circle, do a circle of dimension of radius 50 and another circle of radius 35. After that, I will extrude boss it. Exit extrude boss it to 15 unit. Go to features and extrude boss and extrude boss it to 15 unit. Press OK. Here we can see we have some rectangular shape. Here I have a rectangular shape and another rectangular shape and another rectangular shape. And all the rectangular shape are 45 degree apart from each other. So I will first draw a center line then draw another three center line. I will offset those center line to 30 unit. After that I will extrude both that rectangular size. It to 115 unit so select the top plane again go to sketch normal to it now select a center line draw the center line of 120 unit I mentioned now draw another center line 120 unit 45 degree angle and draw the last center line 120 unit now press ok as we can see i have drawn all the three rectangle now i will offset to rectangle to 30 unit now go to uh, offset into this in either side it will be 15 units so i will select this one and select the bidirectional and cap in and line and select all three three center line now press ok now i will select this line and convert entities and select the inner circle also and then convert entities now i will trim all the unnecessary part with the rectangle so trim everything with the rectangle So trim this part to unjoin the rectangles. Okay, now I have all the three rectangles I need. Now isometric it. Now I will the extrude boss it to 115 unit. Now go to features and extrude boss. Extrude boss it to 115 units. Now press OK. Here we can see every rectangle has a cut here. So and they are apart from 30 unit from every side and from 15 unit from the bottom. So I will cut all this I should cut into all these three rectangular size. So first I will select the first one and then select sketch. Now normal to it. Now select the, the corner rectangle and draw a corner rectangle. Now go to span dimension as you can see it has 50, 50 uh, 65 minus 15 unit so i will spend dimension it this side 65 minus 15 unit which will be 50 and it is apart from the bottom is 15 unit and from the side it will be 30 unit now press ok now isometric it now go to features and select is to cut and select up to surface and select the upper uh, select the other end of the surface now press ok and now do this for the second rectangle 
select the first face of the second rectangle now select a sketch now normal to it now select the corner rectangle place the corner rectangle now select is my dimension dimension the rectangle back to the side 215 unit and it is separate from the bottom 15 unit and apart from the side is 30 unit now isometric it now features then go to start cut and select up to surface and select the other surface of the rectangle now press ok and you also have to do this for the third rectangle also now select this rectangle now sketch now normal to it now select a corner rectangle place the corner rectangle and dimension it is as usual 30 unit then from the bottom 15 unit and on the side 30 unit it will be 15 50 unit so redimension it to 50 unit okay now isometric it now go to features and extrude cut and extrude cut select it to up to surface and select this surface now press okay now we can see we have to do draw this circular part in this circular part we have we see that it has a dimension of radius 70 and another radius of 60 which leads to 10 unit and we have another fillet but semi circular size shape which will be 25 unit so if i draw a rectangle uh, of 35 unit and outer rectangle uh, if i draw a circle of inner radius of 35 unit and outer radius of 70 unit then i fillet that to 25 unit i will get the this semi circular shape at the top so i'll select the top face and then sketch then normal to it now i will select a circle and draw a circle of 70 unit of ra radius now press ok and draw another circle of 35 unit 35 unit radius now press ok now isometric it and here we can see it has a extrude boss of 50 so go to features and extrude boss it to 50 unit and direction change now press ok and here we can see we have a cut of uh, this side of the radius so i will select this top face and now sketch now normal to it now i'll select a line draw a line here and draw another line of 270 degree Now go to my dimension dimension to this side to 45 plus 45 plus 45 plus 90 now press okay. 225 unit now select this this li line and convert into this now trim all the unnecessary part this part at this part now press okay now isometric it now go to features and extrude cut extrude cut it ok now i will do fillet of 25 so go to fillet option and fillet it to 25 select this circular line and select this lower circular line now place ok as we can see we have 
finished our drawing 3d sketch so thank you for watching till the end thanks for watching and keep learning be different